Uh, so good morning, my name is uh, Alain Vidal, I'm the uh, director of the uh, Challenge Programme on Water and Food of the CGIR, uh, the Consultative Group on International Agricultural Research. And I'd like today to invite you for to, to our next uh, International Forum on Water and Food that will uh, take place in uh, near Johannesburg in South Africa uh, from the 14th to the 17th of November this year. Well, I think this forum will be uh, the water and food event of the year. Uh, it, it comes very timely. Uh, we are on a year where uh, everyone recognizes that uh, we have a looming uh, food crisis that we we'll need to uh, feed uh, uh, increasing population will probably need to double the food production by 2050 and at the same time uh, a lot of people have realized that uh, we've reached the uh, planetary boundaries that we've come to a time where uh, our resources are limited especially water and so we will need to produce more food and at the same time the uh, water resources are limited uh, we have a few examples of such uh, successful solutions. Uh, one example I've had, I have in mind is in the uh, uh, Andes region in uh, South America, where a series of mechanisms to share benefits between upstream and downstream user, users show that we can at the same time maintain or even improve the water ecosystems, the rivers, the wetland state, and at the same time increase the income of uh, farmers through better farming, better conservation agriculture and better uh, livestock practice. What I'd like to see from this conference is a series of uh, solutions that really address uh, the development challenges in these uh, six large river basins where our program is working we would really like to uh, uh, address ways to uh, increase the food security and the income of the rural poor through better water management practices and better uh, benefit sharing mechanisms. Well. well, among the future challenges there is clearly an emerging one which is the uh, the growth of hydropower generation in many of these uh, uh, river basins. Uh, what we are exploring and quite successfully already on the Mekong is identify uh, solutions where uh, different users from uh, water infrastructures could benefit from them, which means hydropower but also at the same time better regulation to uh, better water management to uh, increase uh, crop production and, and enhance fisheries while at the same time generating the hydropower which is needed by those riparian countries. Well, this forum, uh, like the two previous ones we had uh, a few years ago, uh, won't be a classical conference where you have keynote speakers and people presenting scientific papers and, and a lot of other people's uh, people listening. Uh, it will be a forum where everyone is a potential keynote speaker. Uh, everyone will have an opportunity uh, to uh, bring his or her new ideas, challenges, uh, and bring energy to uh, this forum. So uh, we look forward to welcome you in South Africa uh, from the 14th of November this year.